Hi everyone, my name is Isabel Niu and I'm a product and tech leader with 20 years experience working for startup and tech companies. Today I'd like to talk about the fundamental principle that guide us in building quality software. As we explore this topic, I deep dive into four key principles that help shape and define our approach to creating software that's not just functional but exceptional. Firstly, there's the principle of user-centric design. In essence, this means that when you design software, you put the user at the heart of the process. Strive to understand their needs, their tasks, and how they interact with your product. This is about jobs to be done if you know the product management speak. You need to value their feedback and use it as a tool to refine and improve your design. The goal here is to enhance the user experience, which in turn improve the quality of your software. The second principle that guides you in software development is software modularity. It means that you aim to create a system whose components can be separated and then recombine as needed. This is crucial because it allows you to update one module without affecting the others. It also allows you to have different teams to work on different modules simultaneously and parallelizing the work, thereby improving productivity and development speed and velocity. The third principle involves rigorous testing. This is a critical aspect of building quality software. I believe in unit testing, integration testing, system testing, and user acceptance testing. And you need to choose the right kind of testing based on the needs of your software and the requirements that you've got. Rigorous testing allows you to identify and correct any bugs or inconsistency that may exist in your software. It also ensures that the software that you create meets the specified requirement, whether it is functional requirements or non-functional requirement as needed. Finally, I believe in the principle of continuous integration and delivery. This involves the regular integration and testing of code changes. By doing this, you can detect and address errors quickly and efficiently, reducing the time and effort required to fix them. There is a huge difference between fixing an error that you discover after 10 or 12 weeks of development and an error that you discover after a day or two of development. More importantly, it ensures that your software can be reliably released at any given time in time, which enhances the speed and frequency of delivery. This is the key to incremental releases and iterative development. These four principles, firstly, user-centric design, secondly, software modularity, thirdly, rigorous testing, and last but not least, continuous integration and delivery form the cornerstone of my approach to building quality software. These principles guide you in creating software that is not only functional and efficient, but also user-friendly, reliable, and scalable. Always remember that the quality of your software directly affects the satisfaction of your customers, and satisfied customers are integrated to success of your business and your product. In closing, I like to say that things, these principles are not exhaustive and they can actually vary based on the specific needs and requirements and specific software development methodology that you are using. However, they serve as a solid foundation in your quest to build quality software that meets and exceeds the expectation of your customer. Follow me for more videos on leadership, software development and content around those topics as well. Thank you.